Hi everyone. Hi YouTube. Hi VODs. Uh, welcome, as my partner T said and coughed into the microphone. Uh, we are playing Donkey Kong Country 3, Dixie Kong's Double Trouble. Uh, T is playing Dixie. I am playing uh, Kitty. And during our last playthrough, we beat this dude. And now I don't know where to go, do you? Okay. So yeah, we beat the the tree. Oh, what? Oh, I guess we go down here. Lake Orangutanga. All right, here we go. Uh, T, if you need to do gross mouth stuff, move the mic away from your mouth when you do it. Into the mouth, got it. <coughs> <coughs> hey. Bring your ear close. I have no. a sec I have a secret. No. <coughs> There's your secret. Why are you so gross? <coughs> I've been watching your progress for a while, Kongs. The name's Blunder, but you call me Mr. Blunder. So you think you're going to find everything in this game, eh? Don't even know where the lost world is. Whoops, I think I just let a cat out of the bike. Oh, okay. What, what do? What do? This is what opened up is Blunder's booth, but I wonder if we need to get whatever it is from this guy's store in order to go do Blunder's booth. Okay, so he wants us to be faster than like two minutes or something, or 115. Okay, so we need to do faster than 115 on this one. All right, T, get ready. Okay. There's a lot of concentration going on. It's okay. You still got it. You can do it. Very, very concentrated. And here come the butterflies. Roll for good measure, yes. Halfway point, okay. Here comes the butterflies again, rolling to dodge and kill those dudes. Uh oh, wow, that was very close. Still underwater. Now we're out of the water. Back on land, killing the dudes. Back underwater. Oh, cog. Just another cog in the machine. Whoopsie. All right, well, we're not gonna be this in three seconds. Get it, yes! Okay, well, I take that back. We beat it in under three seconds. Okay, go talk to the dude. Oh, it's me again. Here you go. Well, you gave me the easy part, so. No, I really did. What up, Dungey? <coughs> So mad. Didn't even give us anything. Oh. 
What? Oh, oh, fancy. Okay, we need to remember this. X, X, B, X, X. Okay. Okay, I did it. All right, more birds. Dungey, how are you feeling today? Okay, so that's great that we did that and all, but I still don't know where we're supposed to go. Better, good. Oh, I guess I should probably save though. Now that I just went past Wrinkly's cave. I'm glad Cranky doesn't know about this new console. If he did, I'd never... Something. Okay. So, maybe we talk to this guy now. Because he's telling us we don't even know about the secret world. Do we need to discover... Or the, the lost world. Do we need to discover the lost world before we continue? Okay, hold it there. Okay. Or you can talk. Either way. My boob's not gonna talk. It doesn't have a lot to say. But like if you if you look at the mic levels, if it's not like pointing at a face, it doesn't catch levels very well. Okay, so yeah, I legit have no idea where to go right now. Oh, what? Okay, so I guess that band-aid was a patch that we needed to give to Funky. Heck yeah! Let's go! Wee! Oof. Ugh. Okay. Oh, so we have a, a selection of worlds we can go to. T, do you have any opinions? Okay, but what about here, which is clearly something? I'm gonna go to this. Well, first I'm gonna land up here, I guess, because I'm interested in what's going on over here. Okay, so this is Bramble's bungalow. Let's talk to Bramble. Ah, hello there, kitty. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Bramble the... Since I've been unable to grow those to study plants, I've been taking a look at animals. Hey, Pearl. All right, so I think I want to go to this one because it looks less, it looks more awful than the other one. Mechanos. Fireball Frenzy. What is this Hoover Dam shit? I am talking. This is the quality stream you've came here for. <clears throat> Whoa. This level is very red.
Uh. Oh, excuse me. That one was a wet, wet burp. Yeah, T's having some allergy stuff going on today. All oh, yeast halfway. Oh, nice. This is kind of neat music, and it's really different from anything else in the games, or like in the series. Oh. Well, when we go back in like 100% it, we can get it done. No, that's like, that looks like some invisible wall bullshit. Ooh, no spider. This is what happens when the floor is lava. They're shooting balls of fire at you. Great balls of fire. Con. Okay. Concentration setting in. We're both focused. Ooh, almost got kicked off. Ooh. Uh oh. Dang it. You got too greedy. Will T make the same mistakes I did? Nope, T will do it all his own way. Nice. This is intense. Ah, ah. You can't land on him with the barrel. <gasps> oh. Oh. Those flaming hot Cheetos are no joke, man. You can do this. Whoa, nice. Yeah! And that's the DK coin, folks. This is a lot like uh, the first King K. Rool fight, that, that little segment there. Oh, you know what? No, I don't see it as Cheetos. I see them as little Captain Crunch, like, crunch colored crunch berries. I failed you, team. Now, Dave's going to show you how it's done. Here we go. Watch this skill right here. Pro. Her eyes are closed. Just kidding. They're not closed. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, shit. Did you see that? I told you, pro. Pro is playing. Bow to your master. These bees can buzz off. <laughs> I bet you didn't know I was going to say that. Oh, clutch. Uh, like I said, pros playing. Get on your knees and pray. 
And a silver coin. All right. Let's go. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. Here we go. This is the part where I uh, got fireballed to the face. Oh, secret. That would be funny. A blindfold run and someone tells you to go or jump or stop. Yeah. Having watched people do speed runs, it's... I, I, I'm pretty confident they can probably do it in their sleep. So I've actually um, seen the Phoenix Ascending playing Resident Evil and I think Alien Isolation blindfolded um, with Red Wolf telling him where to go. It's pretty impressive. Whoops. That's a more challenging challenge. And you can't try it again because I died. Sorry, my bad. That's okay. Now you can show us how it's done. What the fuck? Are, are you trying to kill us? Not with that attitude. You have to go for it. You have to jump over the lava and then do it. And, you know, that works too. <laughs> oh well. It's not what you meant to do, but it is what happened. And we'll live. Okay, yeah. Y you'll live. I will be dead. But that's okay. Because you're going to get us bald in the face. 